Hi. Uh, very quick video. So antenna doesn't work. So I bought this car for 500 bucks. It's really nice. It's really like it. I really like it. So I bought a couple pieces. So I like this car because it's a. Uh, if it's something it doesn't work, so it's just um. Uh, so it's just a. Uh, just a lubricate and it's gonna work. So just one more thing. So in my case, the antenna didn't work. So I got the one antenna from the pick and pull. Mine was broken. So mine was broken right here. So I, I changed another one. I bought another one on pick and pull, used one, but it didn't really work. So, so yours, it's really easy to undo. There's just a one screw right here. Uh, it holds right here and then it's, uh, it's gonna be panel like this. Just the screws and number eight. And you just need number 10 for the ground here. And my, so just, uh, just running over. So this is how it should be. This is how you're gonna see your your antenna. So it's gonna be plug over here. And the problem is, so what I did, I checked the the frequency over here. Does it work or not? Does it have a positive, negative, and like a controlling module or something? And so we just can apply the the plus and minus over here. You see this here? And let's see, does it work? Does it go up and down? And if it's yes, so your problem is probably in this box. So you just uh, remove the. Sorry. So we will try to do it really fast. So you see my face, my ugly face. And it's very really easy. So you just um, open the box, and inside it's going to be something like this. So I got this um, again from the used car. Just I took this from the broken antenna. So in my case was this one that was a really big transistor. And this sir just rusted out. And this diode rusted out. It's really hard to find it. And then I will maybe I'll show you how my micro scam or microchip looks like. And it's um so I cleaned everything, but this one was not giving the, the certain resistance. So that's how I, I checked. So it was kind of right because it was like one time it's it was showing the resistance, another time it was zero. So if you have a if the motor works, you can open it by this just torque, just undo the torque, and you will see everything. I just lubricate it and put it everything together. So what's my goal is. I'm gonna do this one. I just uh, I will put it in because there is nothing else to break in this. Yes, there is nothing to break over here. Everything should be fine. Yeah, so I looked on the internet, so um, it shows that it's a 124, 140, 126, 202 C class. They have the same, same antenna and the same control module, or wherever they're calling this. So, I just can replace it or just to change the, change the parts like I did on my previous one. And I saw on uh, eBay this is 25 or 28 dollars, but it's uh, like a transfer to Canadian money. It's it's maybe 30 bucks, and they want to for the shipping another 15 dollars. So it's going to be kind of kind of a lot of money. And I believe it should work. Yeah, yeah I'll show you. Uh, like uh, I'm continuing my video about the antenna. So this is how it is, how it should be, like uh, attached, but I will I'll put more, like I will put everything back, but it's um, 
so uh, I forgot to say this is video it's not about um, how to fix the crap it's it's the video about how to bring the car alive back to life and make everything works and just enjoy your life this one I will I'll paint it in the winter time so how I said we just plug that box and it should start working uh, but I'll give you like a small small a small tip it will work as soon as I plug them so you see it's raising it's very strong motor over there and it's um, everything is works I just believe it's my fault a little bit bent it but it's it's fine honestly I was all my life I wanted that kind of antenna on my car and then I bought the car it was a Toyota with that kind of antenna and I've always been scared that it's gonna break because of the bunch of um, dust and dirt so again like I said this is for the people who who want to make the, the everything works on the vehicles it's not who's like a, because I have this this car and my wife she's driving the X5 and like it's it's really nice fast car but it's just um, it's too new for me this is 2010 just uh, just finish up the production line and it's, it's really comfortable really nice compared with uh, with this car it's a little bit tight and a little bit rough accelerates really fast and has all the features what could be like most of people would, would like it so one day I will share my my thoughts about this car what I agree and what I disagree but we fixed the antenna and like I said it should be this thing over here back here be sure that you have here just put it in and all this screw is gonna be there and that's it and you're done uh, thanks for watching we can check it out my other videos I know they're like on different topics but that's how it is thanks for watching bye